Hi friends, welcome back to my channel Vlog. Today with me I have the Mazda CX-5 and let's review it. So let's start with the design of the Mazda CX-5 The grille It's a really big grille And they've got a cool design in them And I like it And it shines when the sun hits them And it's in piano black So that gives the car a much more sporty appearance Moving on to the badge It's the Mazda badge It's really big also Then you've got chrome surrounding the grille And that gives a car lots of presence that is really nice so your led lights they're very sleek and narrow and they look really nice and you got this little bit of chrome underneath it and that also makes it look cooler so the hood it's really long and it looks nice because it's got a few creases in them and it's a little bit of pointy when you come into the front see it's got very sharp edges in the front and you got a crease which starts over here and comes to here and it continues all the way till here and you also got like a cut over here which makes it look even nicer and it's the same on the other side also so the lower bumper of this car it's nothing special but it looks nice so you got some body colored trims over here which makes it look nice and you got your fog light over here with our fake ones they're absolutely fake ones there is no need of fake ones on cars and then you got your bumper over here it's plastic i preferred if it was like body colored but it's fine and now let's move on to the side of the car so when i look at the side of this car it's tall and it looks nice it's got lots of creases going on i like it there is something special about it so let's start with the wheels i like the wheels they're really nice looking and they are 18 inches rims and the two-tone which makes them look nice and you got a master badge over here and the surround for the wheel is in plastic which is also nice much better when it's in the wheel arch than it was on the front bumper i like that here on the side nice then moving up you got your door mirrors and they're nothing too special uh they work they can fold in the mirrors automatically and open and you got blinkers on them over here and you got the small chrome strip which starts over there and comes all the way to here i would have liked it if it had gone all the way around so the door handles they're nothing too special but it's got key entry so it's locked now and it unlocks automatically i find that cool because it's not there on many cars, it's there on this and it's a practical family car, nice. So you got a crease which starts over here and comes all the way to here and then you got a crease which starts over here and goes to the back and you got another crease which starts over here and then it comes all the way to the back and it goes up and then to there. That is really nice. So then you got your side skirts. It's plastic. Now let's go to the back of the CX-5. So the rear design of the Mazda CX-5. It's nice. I like it. You got a roof spoiler over here. It's not really big. But there is a roof spoiler. Then you got a Mazda badge over here. And over here again. You got very sleek thin LED lights and they look nice so you got a sky active technology badge over here so what that means is that you get better fuel efficiency and better output and it's still up by Mazda then moving down you got your exhaust pipes over here and it's not a fake exhaust pipes that is good Mazda it's a real exhaust pipe good job I hate cars with fake exhaust pipes because 
You don't need fake exhaust pipes. You have an exhaust or not. Yeah. It's that simple. Mazda keeping it real. Yeah. And over here, you got your CX-5 badge. You got three creases on the body. So, one which starts over here and goes to there. And you got another one which starts over here and comes all the way to the other side. I like the design of this car very much. But the only thing that gives away is the front end. That's not something I prefer. The side looks really nice, but the back is really good. I like the back design of this CX-5. Nice job, Mazda. And now, let's check out the boot of the Mazda CX-5. So, the boot. It's an electronic tailgate. Nice. And you got 506 liters of boot space here. Nice. Uh, you could load a lot of stuff and you got some practicality also. Like some Thailand hooks over here and you got an auxiliary port over there and it's nice. And you can also fold down the seats from here. And then you have to just lean in and give it a touch. Same on the other side. But this just goes down straight. That is a nice touch. And now, let's go inside of the Mazda CX-5. So, you got your steering wheel. It's wrapped in leather and it's really nice to hold. And you got two sides full of buttons. So, on this side, it's all about the cruise control. And on this side, it's about controlling the infotainment system. And that small screen over there. Then, coming back to the steering wheel, you got your master badge over here, and the cinder bursting. It's not too plastic, it's in a nice quality material. Nice. So, over here are your driver's gauges, and in the middle, it's your speedo, and on the left, it's your rev counter, and on the right, you got a small screen which shows your fuel efficiency and your kilometers and how much fuel you got left in your petrol tank so your infotainment system you got a few menus the first one is applications in where it shows your fuel economy and you can connect to apple carplay and android auto then you got your entertainment over here communications navigation and settings the infotainment system is really not very high-tech and clever but it's there for most people's uses so it's fine and these are your infotainment controls so you got navigation home entertainment favorites and this is the button for everything you do and this is for going out and that's your volume control moving up you got your CD player over here then your air vents over here they got a nice design shape on them and you got chrome surrounding it I like that really nice and moving down you got heated seats which is not required in the summer now and the air conditioning is really nice because it's cooling me down you also got heated steering wheel and moving down you got the climate controls so you got two some climate control and over here is your start stop button then you got this really nice wood over here this is better wood than i found in some other cars which i review and it's subtle so you don't feel it's there un until you notice it but it's nothing too showy it's just there and it's classy i like that so you got some storage area over here and it's rubberized so that things just don't slide around and you got a 12 watt socket so and over here is your gear selector and you got chrome surrounding it and that's all very nice but it's a dog like gearbox so do you know how to put it in reverse well i'll figure it out i will tell you if you own this car and you don't know how to do it watch my video full clutch put it down left and up and now it's in reverse that's how you do that then over here you got your parking brake 
and there's your auto hold stop so you got two cup holders over here so your armrest it's paddling leather and to be tell you the material quality in this car is absolutely brilliant but mostly our softest materials over here and over there anyway back to the armrest and inside over here you got a 12 watt socket your auxiliary port over here two usbs and you got lots of storage over here including a tray nice which stays up over here so your seats they're leather and you got heated seats also and they're really nice to sit in and i love these seats and they are electronically adjustable so and it's very easy to recline them and yeah it's really nice seating positions and you also got some bronze stitching on it which makes it cool really nice and i like bronze stitching nice talking about cool things look at the floor mats they have got a really cool texture on them and they're really nice and you got cx5 written also so your glove box it's an average size so you got your eye stop off switch over here your traction control off switch over here your parking sensors off switch over here and the release for your boot opener so the door uh it's also really nice material soft touch materials and bronze stitching over here the door handles are metal you got wood trim over here and chrome over here nice you got your controls for your windows and the mirrors over here and then moving down you got your door bins where you can keep your water bottles and stuff but one big highlight is that you got a Bose sound system which is going to sound absolutely brilliant and that's it for the front of the interior now let's go to the back seats so the space in the back of the Mazda CX-5 yeah you got lots of knee room and you can stretch out headrooms plenty and you've also got armrest the only thing i find annoying is that you put your hand in there uh, that's not really something i like and you got a little bit of storage over here and you got two usb sockets over here and over here you got your air vents on the rear seats and it's surrounded in chrome nice and you got some storage over here where you can keep something and moving to the other side and you got door bins over here where you can keep your water bottles and stuff and that's it for the rear seat of the Mazda CX-5 and now let's check out the engine so the engine it's a 2.2 litre 4 cylinder engine and it's a diesel it's got 150 horsepower 380 nm of torque and it's front wheel drive and driven by a 6 speed manual gearbox so that's it for the video hope you enjoyed it and the Mazda CX-5 is a very good car and see you soon Bye!